Hi, welcome again to my Antergos system. We're talking about open box and we've made an article on Eric Dubois about it. And the right mouse click is at this moment still the Nemo uh, right mouse click, meaning I started Nemo and I have in the meantime already made some modifications. So I like Nemo and I want to be able to create folders on my desktop and so on and to work on here, that's fine. But I also want from time to time not um, not to be able to do this and have my right mouse click and have my open box menu. So I have this shortcut Ctrl Alt N which is going to kill Nemo. And then we have this normal and here we have also an extra button to kill Nemo but it's killed again already so it will not execute anything. So this is my way of um, getting rid of Nemo altogether and have the right mouse click at my disposition. In the meantime, <coughs> I want to go over what I've done. As you can see, this is not the same uh, directory in, in, uh, that I had yesterday. So I changed things around. The applications are up here and everything is under here. But here is my exit button, which is going to open this new icon team I've made, Sardi um, OB Logout is the name, or Open Box Logout. Mm. And I have added the things that matter, I've put them all in advanced settings, like customize the Compton, Compton configuration is the transparency, is the shadow and all that. My Conky file, which is in my second screen, that's working there. Alex appearance is icons and themes, and the Open Box configuration. The file for Tim2, which is down here, I've, I've changed that as well here. Tim2 configuration uh, wizard, the keyboard shortcuts, manage keyboard shortcuts, so the OB key that's in here. Open box to reconfigure, open box to auto start the RC in the menu, so the keys in the menu. But the menu is in my case generated with OB menu generator, so I pipe make a static one with icons or without icons. I can edit my schema here and my config there. And that's about it. So it's better that we take a look now at what I have done. The schema is the most interesting one. So I've turned things around. We can edit or we can change GM run if we want to uh, have that on a later date, we can. So here starts my advanced settings, customize open box, open menu, customize open box and menu. In the meantime, I see I can, well, delete this one like so. Doesn't matter really, it's just text. So customize all that. Reconfigure, Generator, so all these lines that are in here will be found of course back in this uh, script here, in this file. And I've chosen then to go for OB Logout, so the program OB Logout is providing us with a beautiful way to, to stop our system, which is this one which I prefer th more than the one I used to have, exit. So it's all choices you will see in a few months time when I s look back at my tutorials, then I'll say, ha, huh, I changed a lot of things. So it's normal that uh, this is an evolution. And um, I only wanted to point out how interesting OB menu, menu is the generator, how interesting, how flexible it can be, how easy it is to read and to copy paste and put things back on the top because this one this and this were down here and and so on i made a nice little icon here as well for um, nemo to kill it it will be in the next updates for uh, sardi and that's how we proceed how we can make this probably will become bigger as well so all my customization, things that I will come across that I say, I want to, I always go to this file, I always go to that file. I'll add them here 
so that uh, things are easy accessible so I hope um, yeah there's maybe an issue that um, maybe when you start you say well how does he how does he get it I shown it in another tutorial but anyway maybe it's a good thing to do it again so we have this OBA menu generator type minus H and read it says if you want to have an, a new file well you these two are your your configuration files but if you want to create something you should run one of these so you should really type OB menu generator and then you choose if you want a static one with icons or not and then basically the th what's now created is the same thing that's been done when you have uh, this one I think static menu with icons or without icons that's without icons so let's give it a try so you can see it as well so you can have it like so as well if you don't like all these icons this is more serene it's calmer and it's uh, also very slick so these are the choices have fun with ob menu generator and well change it to your personal liking and that's the fun okay